start with using a sediment filter, carbon filter, reverse osmosis, and UV filter. We have an EC controller. After all that, it pumps the water into a holding tank. From the holding tank, we transfer it over to our mixing tanks. Mixing tanks is where we take all of our raw material and make it into our fertilizer. From the fertilizer, we run it through a one micron filter. From the one micron filter, it's run into our totes, 300 gallons at a time. From there, we take it over to our bottling warehouse. My name's Philip Levitt. I'm the owner of Emerald Triangle Products and the inventor of our product line. And today, I would like to take you for a tour of our bottling plant here in Humboldt County, California. We dump the bottles into this uh, reservoir. elevator lift here brings the bottles up into this circular rotator here which separates them they will then come through one at a time to head toward the bottle orienter it orients the bottle so when the bottles come in if they're bottom backward they slide through as they are if they come through with the bottom backwards and the mouth up a hook catches them flips them over so they're all oriented once the bottles come out we move down here where they're then fed into the filling line when six of them are in there these metal rods that are operated at high pressure closes the filling line comes down it fills according to a preset amount of time so that they not only fill but in order to make sure every bottle is completely full they fill until there's an overflow going back into the reservoir so every bottle comes out exactly the same And the bottles then move on out down the line to the capping machine. As they come through, the cap hits the tip of the bottle and falls perfectly straight up and down onto the bottle. Then it goes through this first wheel here where it's gently threaded on to get the bottle cap just right. And the second wheel does about 90% of the torque to get it on. And the last one is the final amount of torque. By using uh, high pressure air, as this thing rotates, only the caps that are oriented right will come out of the chute. The rest of them fall back in the bin and they go through the cycle again. So you get all the caps coming out exactly oriented. The foil sensor senses whether there's a foil in the cap, and if there isn't, this little foot knocks it out so that everything that goes through the induction sealer has a seal when it comes out. Then they turn around and we come into the labeler. The bottles come through, this little round black rotating wheel slows the bottles down so that they pass through on this guide rail into the labeler with a little bit of space between them so that the sensor has time to sense each bottle separately. They get labeled, they come out the end onto this rotating table. They are then placed in boxes. fed through our semi-automatic box taper and out it comes where it's put on a pallet stored until you place an order for it. I've tried very hard to be the best in the world at what I do and how I do it. So when you get a bottle of product from us, you can be sure that we spent a lot of time trying to do it right.